Hey, good morning, risers. This is Patricia Jo Grover, the Goal Achievement Strategist, and today is Monday, February 26th. Um, you know, uh, what was it, over the weekend or whatever, I had told you I was going to try to start taking Saturdays to be able to spend, you know, on myself for self-care, those types of things, because my I had really felt I was depleted. Well, if you can hear in my voice, it wasn't just feeling depleted because of being emotionally or mentally tired. It was because I am starting to battle some sicky sickness. So you're going to hear it in my voice. That doesn't mean I'm going to stop doing the videos. So even if I can hardly talk, I'm going to be doing my videos for you guys. But um, we're still talking about planning and, and talking about things that become challenges for us. Because again, we're risers. We rise above the challenges that life bring our way. So I'm going to talk to you a little bit more about this stuff this morning. So, but um, here right now we are as it, every morning we're in my kitchen. And um, so uh, back to everything that again is helping me through um, with my, my health and wellness journey is the ISO T again here. And so the ISO T um, that's 16 ounces of water mixed with the with the instant tea, or I use the base of the brewed tea and add instant tea in different flavors. But today I just have the regular ISO tea. The blossom is, I take three of those, and blossom is for um, menopausal health. The HSN is hair, skin, and nails, and the NRG gives energy and focus. And all of those are capsules, so I take the capsules with the tea, and then the Nautica, the Nautica Sea Moss. So you can tell I've taken this foil packet this morning. That is for all over um, body nutrition. And um, Sea Moss doesn't sound like it. it would taste very good, but this one has the um, <coughs> base. Um, the flavor has a um, coconut sugar and a um, dragon fruit. <laughs> there we go. I told you. Um, the Nutriburst is the liquid vitamin in a bottle. And I just, that's just a cap full of that every day. Or it also comes in the foil pack, just like the sea moss does for travel. And the resolution drops are weight, uh, appetite suppressant in a bottle. And it's half a cap of that, you know, every time. And then here again, my Delgada coffee. And this morning I just have my coffee. And my beautiful flowers. You can tell again, I it, it's recent since I've gone grocery shopping. So it's around here. And again, I promise again, I'm, <laughs> you can tell even when I'm sicky sick, I'm going to be here guys. So, uh, and showing up authentically as, as who I am. <clears throat> so, um, yeah, I don't know. I started taking some zinc, um, because I thought I thought it was allergies because the weather here has been so strange because it's been warm and not warmer than normal. And some days there hasn't been a lot of snow or whatever. So there's mold, there's wetness and stuff. And so it could be related to my allergies, but it could be when I went to get my nails done the other day, could have been something in the nail salon. So, but here I am, I'm not letting this stop me. So talking about, as I'm getting on the bike here, um, going back to, to when I was talking about planning days. Okay. So it's Mondays are my planning day. And I had, I had shared with you guys before that, okay, there's 92% of the people I call, I call this the magic carpet ride called life. We're all on this magic carpet ride, right? 92% of the people are riding along on this magic carpet. And they're just sitting back, kicking back and just letting life take them wherever, right? But then they're complaining all the time that they're not getting where they want to be in life. They're not achieving anything. They're, they're you know, they're just expecting things to just happen, right? So there's 92% of the people. Then there's 7% of the people that learn to operate the GPS system, the growth potential system that, that I teach and is part of my conquering skills education, my proprietary conquering skills education, that they learn how to navigate this GPS system, the growth potential system, and they are achievers. They are able to achieve one thing and then, you know, whatever their dreams and goals are, they are able to do that. 
But then there's a one percenters and I'm a one percenter and that's how planning days keep me in the one percent. And what I mean by that is because I don't just have, have, haven't just achieved one goal. I have one and then I achieve that and I go after another one and after another one and after another one. I have many big dreams and goals and I'm not afraid to go after them. And as risers, I'm trying to teach you guys all the different things that go into being one of the 1%. So I have shared with you openly and honestly that I am a recovering perfectionist. And, and I, I think I've shared a video before about perfectionism. And if we, if we just want everything to be perfect, nothing's ever going to be perfect. If we wait for things to be perfect before we begin anything, you'll never get started. You won't even get started to get started. So, so become a recovering perfectionist and, and, and you'll, you'll like, you'll ha be happy and you'll thank me for that. But today I want to talk about some other things that stand in our way. Okay. So, and, um, so I work, I, this is work I do with my clients all the time. So, um, I, I will be um, sharing some of this stuff with you throughout this week because they're, they're, they're things that stand in our way. So the word for today, and I want you to think about this, choose for yourself, choose for yourself is, would it be, because I have it like a, a checkbox, right? So this word, and I'll explain what it is, and then you put if it's in one side of the box or, or the other, okay? So one side is it goes in your toolbox if you're not one of these things, one of these people. But if it, if you are one of these people, it goes to the gravestone because that's where dreams go to die if you if you keep up with what's going on with this word. So the word is procrastination. Procrastination, guys, okay? So there's nothing more stressful than having something weigh on you until the very last minute, followed by the panic of not being certain you can get it done. <clears throat> If you want to make an easy job seem hard, make sure you don't don't do it as well, you know, because you so you couldn't do it as well as you thought you could. Keep putting it off because procrastination is actually the top form of self sabotage. <clears throat> okay, guys. So you hear my dogs going crazy, but they're seeing something else. Could be a bird or squirrel or whatever, because it's actually warmer today and the sun's out. So there's animals running around. But anyway procrastination it is your enemy and and if you connect procrastination and perfectionism boy oh boy you're in for trouble right so so i really want you to think about this in your life in in things that you're trying to do do you procrastinate because if you procrastinate that's again that's where dreams go to die that goes, that goes to the gravestone, right? But if you're not a procrastinator, it goes in your toolbox because it is a tool. It is something that is a positive for you if you don't procrastinate. So that's what I wanted to leave you with this morning. Again, and I'm showing up authentically. If tomorrow, if I sound like Daisy Duck or if I, if I can, if I sound like a, a bullfrog, I'm still going to be here. So I'm get now I'm finishing up with you and going to get my hour done on the bike while I can still breathe, right? Um, but until then, guys, you're my risers, and we're going to rise above the challenges. So until, until next time, rise above the challenges that life bring your way, and have a great day.